health is brought to you by Aunt Martha's. It is one of the toughest decisions a family will have to make, knowing when it's time for a loved one to receive assisted living and long-term care. Here with more insight, Joe Edel with Lighthouse Financial and Jane Huckel with Informed Decisions. Welcome. Thank Appreciate you. you guys being here. We're going to pack a very big subject into a very short amount of time. Okay. Um, so, Jane, let's start with you. You tend to focus more on the decision-making process and how to have these conversations yes. and what to be looking for. So what do we need to know? Well, I am a registered nurse. I've been in long-term care for 30 years. Um, and so there's just a lot of questions that the family has to decide or are in the process of trying to decide. And a lot of it depends on each client. Each client's different, and each client's looking for something different. So You have to know, even to have the conversation to start with, but then once it starts, there are so many different things you have to decide along the way. What are some of the keys that we need to be making sure that okay. we're deciding on? Okay, is mom or dad um, needing care? Are they able to take care of themselves? Are they needing assistance? say in the bathroom or getting dressed um, do they have memory problems memory problems seem to be a big thing uh, and of course depending on their general health what now there are lots of different places they could go and you're talking about everything from assisted living to a nursing facility um, where do you even start to find out who does what and what might fit best for my mom or dad? Well, and again, that depends on their level of care. And um, since I've been in the business for 30 years, I can do some of the assessing as to helping the family decide what way they need to go. And are they able to be at home with some assistance from the outside, or do they need assisted living? Or are we to the point of going to a long-term care facility? And I would assume you would recommend having an expert such as yourself come along to help make some of those decisions. Well, yes, because families really don't know where to start and they don't know the questions to ask. Um, they think that all nursing homes are the same and they're not. They each one have their own individual personality. Mm -hmm. So depending on what they're looking for or what they fa their family needs, makes a difference in what direction we go. It's hard to know what you don't know, and that's exactly. when an expert can yes, help. Yes, right. Joe, uh, the next part of all this is once some of those decisions are made, how do we get them paid for? Can we pay for them? Can we not exhaust every bit of resources that have been built up over time? What part of the process do you play, and where do we start? Yeah, Tim, you're exactly right. I mean, the nursing home costs 6000 a month, 8000 a month, 10000 a month in some cases. And uh, for most families, they could be completely wiped out of all their assets in a matter of a few short years. And as Jane said, families just don't know what to do. They're scared. They are facing a situation that it can be overwhelming and uh, scared and they're fearful of all this and for 30 years I've had the privilege of working alongside families here to help protect their assets their home their bank accounts the farm and other financial assets and our saying is don't go broke in a nursing home mm -hmm. so. from what I understand uh, it's not necessarily just up to the assets you have there are ways that you can better use uh, or utilize Medicaid for example right. to to help uh, how I know we don't have time to get into all of it, but how can you start to utilize those resources? Yeah, there's actually several different government programs that we're able to help maximize and optimize for people. And it's programs that are complex and uh, people don't know all the paperwork and all the rules and what they can do legally and what they can't do legally, of course. And that's where our expertise comes along here is helping people qualify for Medicaid benefits that they are entitled to, that they've paid into, or veterans benefits in many cases as well. And uh, it's just a matter of... Um, you know, a lot of people are just not familiar with op what the options are that they have, whether they're already in the nursing home and have been paying for some length of time or just starting out, uh, like working with Jane here, uh, being admitted to a facility. At what point do you need to start having the financial discussion? Do you have to wait till you know what you need, or is it important to start laying out all those options significantly ahead of time? Yeah, this is actually my 30th year in the business. And uh, I handle cases at all different um, uh, time frames. Uh, most of our cases are actually representing clients that are already in the nursing home or assisted living, many of them for many years, and they're praying privately and they just don't know what options that they have to protect those assets. Uh, and then we have a lot of cases, of course, just starting the process as well. And uh, Jane, I would imagine 
same thing goes for you starting those conversations you can probably never have them too early no. although you can't necessarily make a final decision no and really the sooner the family can get started if they're beginning to see changes in their parents or or brothers sisters whatever it doesn't have to be just mom and dad um, they need to begin to start thinking about things because it's so much easier to make it over a period of time as to have to make it as if it was yesterday. Did I hear $10,000 a month, is that what you said? Yeah, mm -hmm. especially in the Chicagoland area. Wow. Pretty common. Yes. Well, Mom and Dad, you got yourself two weeks. <laughs> two weeks is what I can handle. <laughs> Thank you guys for being here. We yeah. appreciate Thank it. Thank you very much. If you'd like more details, we'll connect you with uh, all of this information through our website. All you have to do is go to CILiving.tv. Coming up.